Uh, earlier this week, the first clinical trial of the vaccine candidate for the virus began in Washington State, as you probably know. The genetic sequence of the virus was first published in January. But thanks to the unprecedented partnership between the FDA, NIH, and the private sector, we've reached human trials for the vaccine uh, just eight weeks later. That's a record by many, many months. It used to take years to do this, and, and now we did it just in a very short while. That's the fastest development in history of what we're doing with regard to the vaccine. We're making very, very big progress. Today, I can announce further steps to expand testing capacity. We're working with several groups to determine if the self-swab, a much easier process than the current process that's uh, not very uh, nice to do, I can tell you, because I did it. Uh, but uh, we have a current process that's a little bit difficult. If you have it done, uh, the, uh, the groups are working on determining if a self-swab by an individual is as effective as the other. The other is very effective, very accurate. Uh, but uh, we're going to see if we can do a self-swab, which is uh, — would be a lot more popular, I can tell you that. So uh, — and that would be administered also by a health official, but it would be a lot easier to do. The uh, — the uh, fact is that the health professionals would — it would free — it would free up a lot. Let me just say, the self-swab is what it is. It's a self-swab. You do it yourself. The other has to be issued by a, a health professional. And it's something that uh, is, is quite difficult. And we think it's working out for the self-swab. And uh, if it would test positive, the people would go and uh, they would do what they have to do. But we think that's probably working out. I've asked the FDA to cut through the red tape and reduce regulatory barriers. Uh, we are looking at some very exciting things, and I'm going to be holding a second news conference either today. We're going to talk about the FDA. Uh, some things are happening that are quite exciting. And uh, we're going to be doing that either later today or tomorrow, fairly early tomorrow. Uh, so we'll see what happens. But uh, the FDA, my instructions, is I've been working very, very hard on a number of developments, and we'll be discussing them with you later today or tomorrow. And this afternoon, I'll be meeting with nurses on the front lines of the battle against the virus. They're truly American heroes. They want to get it done. They, they're incredible people. So we're going to be meeting with nurses. And uh, I actually look forward to that. They're very brave. They're taking a lot of risk, and they, uh, they have done an incredible job, and they never complain.